back, everyone. We're going to brighten your day. I, the weather's been so depressing. Let's not talk about the weather. <laughs> you know what today is? Happy birthday to my buddy Yay! Rob. Yeah. Rob, happy birthday. This is when Rob was uh, three years old. Aww. So cute. L look at the bow tie. Yeah. Is that look much older now? Look at those cheeks. And the cheeks <laughs> and the red hair. Yeah. And this is there when he, he was is. fishing. He was six years young. Got the guns out. Yeah. Oh, I mean, <laughs> he was already bodybuilding back yeah. in those days. Rob, are you blushing right now? <laughs> now, Rob, come on in here. You uh, know, Trishna and I and Casey, we were going to get you a cake. And <laughs> to be honest with you, we kind There's of all... There's cake right there. Well, that is cake. <laughs> we, we kind of all ran out of time. <laughs> yeah, did. yeah. So you know where you were on our priority list. But anyways... <laughs> Way down here. <laughs> You never had potato sticks no, before. No, and I got to tell you, I mean, I literally became addicted to them this afternoon. All right, so. These are good. Potato These sticks. These are really good. Happy birthday. I know you like gummies. Yes. So I got you Ooh. some gummies. Ooh. Okay. Um, and I'm not, I, I think you're lukewarm on these, these I like orange the, slices. You know, those are my great-grandfather's favorite. So we always had those going over to his house. So those, yeah. are, those are good. And there was one other gift. Uh, it's going to be a rain check. <laughs> okay. I wanted to get you circus peanuts. Those are my favorite. Because mm -hmm. I know those are your favorite. So if you see me next week and I have no teeth, <laughs> that's why. <laughs> you can I did that for your dentist, fella. Happy birthday. Happy birthday, Rob. Happy birthday. Rob. Happy birthday. Okay. He's a good sport, isn't he? He puts up with me. You have to be a good sport. <laughs> Let's recap and say goodbye to the month of January. The average temperature, believe it or not, was 30.1. That's 5.7 degrees above normal. By the way, snowfall slightly above normal at 16.3, despite all the warm weather. Warmest day was 53 on January 13th. The coldest day was 15. You remember that Saturday, windy? I mean, it was absolutely brutal back on the 20th. And the most snow in one day, our big storm for the month was on January 7th when we had five and a half inches of snow in Albany. It's been tough. If you're a snow lover, it has been tough. Temperatures fairly uniform in the 30s. Once again, clouds uh, persisted today. We're watching this cold front that is going to make a push through us. What we need to do, and this is the bottom line, we need to get some wind in here to get this moisture out. And the wind coming in from the north and northwest behind that front should do the trick for the upcoming weekend. At least we have the chance of getting some sunshine in here. Here's your future cast. Tomorrow morning, there could be a few flurries or a snow shower. That may persist until midday. That's when the, the cold or air is going to start to work in. And there's the chance later tomorrow the dry air will make it in here, a better chance on Saturday. So don't hold your breath for a bright sun tomorrow. Upper 30s to near 40 tomorrow, so another fairly mild day. Uh, the winds pick up, so we'll be cooling off late in the afternoon. Up in the Adirondacks tomorrow, high temperatures, not quite as warm. Cold air comes in quicker. 31 at Indian Lake, Hague 32, 38 at Glens Falls, and 34 at Caroga Lake. Our forecast for tonight down to 33. Could be a little spotty drizzle, a few flurries. For Groundhog Day tomorrow, mostly cloudy. Chances some flurries becoming breezy, a high of 39. No, this is not wrong. Saturday, partly sunny, 36. Sunday, partly sunny in the upper 30s. Dry weather, Monday, Tuesday, Wednesday in the 30s with some sunshine. And then late next week, we got a warm up. In fact, by Friday, partly sunny, 46. Might get close to 50 on Saturday with a chance at some showers. Casey? All righty, Kat.